to me while right now Polk County under a tropical storm watch. This means some people may see tropical storm force winds. ABC Action News reporter Nicole Gregg has been talking to people preparing in Polk County today. She's live in Lake Wales. Nicole, what are you seeing? What are you hearing? Hey, Paul, well, kind of take a look at this. This business seems to be relying on their past experiences. They have the past hurricanes, the dates. So you can see Hurricane Charlie, Francis, there's Jean and Irma down here. And, you know, this is a lot of what we're seeing across Polk County. People boarding up their businesses, their homes um, across the area. We saw families also boarding up their windows. You can see where they're using braces to help keep this fence up here in Lake Wales. And it's not just homeowners. We also found businesses shut down like this Habitat for Humanity uh, with windows boarded up. They also set sandbags outside. Even hotels like this one in Dundee boarding up their 40 or so units. Now, many people seem cautiously optimistic still. They keep saying that Dorian has been so unpredictable. You know, you can't control Mother Nature. You just only sit back and prepare for the worst and hope for the best that happens. So that's why, like this business right here, they've probably been using the same piece of wood throughout the years, throughout the past hurricanes. We want to remind you there are no shelters open in Polk County. School is closed tomorrow and Wednesday. Reporting live in Polk County, Nicole Gregg, ABC Action News. Nicole, thank you.